Should excessive bleed air temperature be detected downstream of the engine pre-cooler, the number one or three engine bleed air trip-off light illuminates. The bleed valve for the appropriate engine automatically closes, as indicated by a drop in duct pressure. This condition could be caused by either a faulty pre-cooler or an improperly operating 13th stage modulating and shutoff valve. The bleed air pack reset button is used to reset the number one or three engine bleed air valve. If the duct temperature has decreased below the trip off value, pressing the button extinguishes the trip off light and restores operation of the engine bleed air valve. Should the temperature of the engine two bleed air entering the cross bleed manifold become excessive, the number two engine high temperature light illuminates. No automatic protection occurs, therefore bleed air flow continues. This condition should only occur at high power settings. When the temperature of the bleed air exiting the number two engine decreases below the trip off value, either by reducing thrust or closing the engine two bleed valves, the number two engine bleed air high temperature light extinguishes. Should the temperature in the number one or three engine strut area become excessive, the respective engine strut overheat light illuminates. Illumination of either light provides visual indications only. No automatic protection occurs. When the temperature in the strut area cools below the trip off value, the engine strut overheat light extinguishes. Bleed air from an engine at idle thrust should not be hot enough to illuminate the strut overheat light. Should excessive temperature in the 48 section lower aft fuselage or keel beam area occur, the lower aft body overheat light illuminates. Illumination of the light provides a visual indication only. No automatic protection occurs. When the overheat condition is reduced below the trip off value, the lower aft body overheat light extinguishes. Due to system design, some pneumatic leaks within the 48 section cannot be isolated by bleed valve closure and must be controlled by reducing thrust.